Initially, when I hear the words hair straightener, I think of a flat iron, which is the normal two-sided clamp that straightens your hair. However, this is not your typical kind of hair straightener. What's up, you guys? Right here with another review. I absolutely love trying out new hair tools. Today, I've got the VGG hair straightener and we are going to test it out and see how well it works. I love the simplicity and sturdiness of the box. First thing you see when you open up the box is the little user guide. And then here's the inside. Very well packaged so it doesn't get damaged in transit. And here we go, look at this. So this is a really good size, easy for traveling. I like that it has the brand on the back of it. Looks like we've got two buttons, power button, and then the plus and minus up and down button. And then we've got a set of teeth on each side. And then we have a different set of teeth in the center. The cord comes with a protector. So let's plug this in and get it heated up. Push the power button to turn it on. So it's heating up right now and you can change the heat setting. So let's just get it right in the middle. So between medium and high. Okay, so the brush does get warm on the back, but it's not too hot to lay on any kind of surface. So we'll just set that right there. First thing I'm gonna do is spray my hair with heat protectant. Always use heat protectant. I'm going to clip up the top half, start with the bottom. I'm gonna brush that through with a regular brush. And then you can see I've got a little bit of wave in my hair from having it up today. So I'm going to take the brush and you can either hold the hair and brush down like this. Wow. Or come from under. And then it kind of just gives a nice sleek look but not stick straight like a straightener would. Kind of gives a little bit of a bevel depending on which way you brush it. So let's do the other side. I like to come from under and over. It's quite a bit easier to use than a hair straightener because it's only one piece instead of two. So you don't have to open and close and you can just use it like a regular brush. So it's super easy. Let's do the second section. Another reason that I like this tool is because it has little barriers on it. Like these teeth on the outside here do not heat up and neither do these. So this will comb through your hair without heat and just the kind of rose gold color plates in the center underneath the black heat up. So even though this is on, I do not feel heat from here. I can touch this whole thing and it's not burning me. It's just the heat plates that are inside the center area. It's a pretty awesome feature, especially if you've got kids running around. Let's do the last section. Now I am a professional hairstylist, so this is something that I would recommend to my clients that don't use hot tools very often because it would be a lot easier for them to operate or for somebody just starting out using heat tools like a teenager or for someone that just needs a quick, easy way to kind of tame their hair in a few minutes. Overall, I like the style, the look. I like that I can't burn myself by touching this, even when the product is on. The design is great. The heat settings are nice as well. So overall, great product. 